Welcome back, everyone. I'm Rob Booker. And in this lesson, I want to take what we've learned about indicators and a little bit about price. And I want to teach you the concept of divergence. This is really important for the free indicator that I give away. And uh, it's going gonna, it's gonna to give you an idea of, well, you know, what I look at on a regular basis. So if we jump over here to MetaTrader, what I've already done is I've already got the momentum indicator set up and ready to go. But I'm going to do that again just to make sure we review it. We click. Zoom in a little bit. Oh, yeah, sure. Okay, so we're going to zoom in a little bit. Yeah. We're going to go to Insert, Indicators, Oscillators, and then we're going to choose Momentum. Now, that's going to pop up the Momentum box. How does that look, Nate? Oh, that's perfect. Okay. We're going to change the period here from 14 to 21. We're going to leave it applied to the close. I'm going to change the color of it to white and the, I don't know, line strength to something more substantial so I can see it on this screen that we're working with today. What that's going to do is it's going to pop up a line across the bottom of my chart, the momentum indicator. The momentum indicator is going to judge momentum rising and momentum falling. Pretty simple. But it's also going to do something really fascinating, as far as I'm concerned anyway. It's going to help us show divergence. Divergence is the disagreement between price and an indicator. Let me give you an example of what I mean. On the chart in front of us right now, and I don't know, you might even want to zoom in here, Nate. This might be worth zooming in. Uh, let me see if we can find an area where we'll do that. Okay, I think we've I think we found an area where we're going to do that. Yeah. Uh, well, I'll take a screenshot of this right here. And Excellent. We want to focus on this area of the chart right here. So you could point the iPhone downward and get it in this area right here. Thanks for bearing with us, everyone. We want to give you a really good look of what we're doing here. It's fine if it jerks a little bit. Okay, I think we should be. All right. So what we have right here is we have price falling. Do you see that? Price is high here and low here. Price is dropping. But something really fascinating is going on with the momentum indicator at the below. It's rising at the same time. At the same time that's going on, the momentum indicator is rising. It's coming up. That's divergence. It's the disagreement between price that is falling and momentum that is rising. This is an early warning sign that price is going to soon travel up. And we could switch to this larger view, Nate. So now we've drawn the divergence on the chart. Price is dropping. Momentum is rising. And it's an early warning sign. Not a guarantee, but it is an early warning sign that price is going to go up. Now we could stay on the big picture here, Nate. That'll be fine. And we're going to take another snapshot. In this example, price is obviously traveling upward. But at the same time, the momentum indicator is falling and it's dropping. This is divergence. I've been doing this now for 18 years, and this is my favorite way to get a look at the market. Take a look and see if you can identify the divergence on the screen here. Price is rising, momentum is falling. Let's see if we could find another example, and we may even have Nate come over and see if he can identify on the screen some divergence. So Nate, I'm going to give you the pen, and you're going to be the star of the show. Can you find on this screen anywhere divergence? Um, right here. OK, show me what you see. I see it going down, but separating up here. All right, that's interesting. That's, that's OK, this is really good. Thanks, Nate, for this is really good. This is a really good. Um, this is a really good lesson. I'm really glad we're doing this. OK, why is that not? Oh, there we go. OK, Nate chose, interestingly, he chose a very small number of bars or candles right here. Typically, you're going to want to look, Nate, for 10, 20, 30 bars or candles. You're going to want to look across a wider group of candles. So if you're playing along at home here, look for a wider area where you either see price rising and momentum falling, or price falling and momentum rising. Can you see that anywhere else on the chart, Nate? It's all right if you can't, but work through it. Well, if I'm looking at a bigger area, um, 
think I can see so stand back. So yeah, there we go. Good. So yeah, going up here. Uh huh. Starting to. Yeah, that's divergence. You got it. Okay. Yeah, that's brilliant. That's totally brilliant. So price is rising in this area, but it's falling here. That's divergence. It's an early warning sign of this move to come. Now you probably identified divergence, Nate. It just wasn't as useful as something that takes a slower amount of time to show up. In this area, we can see that price is dropping, but we can see that momentum is rising. That's divergence as well. Divergence is a reversal indicator. It's not necessarily counter trend. For example, price is rising, but momentum is falling. That says we want to sell soon. That may be a trend trade coordinating with a higher time frame chart. Over here, it's suggesting that we're ready to buy. Price is falling, but momentum is rising, and we want to go with that momentum. That may be uh, in coordination with or in conjunction with or in harmony with a longer time frame chart that shows that we're in an upward trend. Divergence is, in summary, the disagreement between price and an oscillator. You don't have to use the momentum indicator or oscillator for divergence. You can actually use the relative strength index, the MACD, uh, the RS, the RSI, or the stochastic oscillator. You could use a variety of them. Now, when I come back, what I want to show you is a combination of indicators that creates a really powerful divergence. And I want to give you that indicator for free and the lessons necessary to download and install that indicator on your platform. I'm Rob Booker. I'm really happy to be here along with you, uh, along for the ride here. We want to thank our sponsor, Forest Park FX. If you're interested in FX trading, contact Forest Park FX to open an account and get cashback rebates on every trade you place. Go to forestparkfx.com. Forex trading carries a significant risk of loss. Terms and conditions will apply. And we'll see you in the next video, everyone.